don't know how I think of some of my ideas, to be honest. Yeah, I don't know. I just really like crafting. On TikTok and Instagram, I'm known as Home Daddy. The way that this all started was two years ago. My partner and I relocated to California from New York for his job. We had both spent our entire lives in New York, but it was an opportunity for him that we couldn't pass up, but we did it. But then we got here and I kind of fell into a depression. I didn't have my job anymore. I didn't have my family. I didn't have my friends. And I started to just wallow in those sad feelings. I couldn't get out of my funk. And one day I was sitting out on my balcony. I didn't have any flowers. I didn't have any hummingbird feeders. It was just me sitting out there. When a hummingbird appeared out of nowhere, right in front of my face, we locked eyes with each other. And then the hummingbird flew away. But when it flew away, it took with it all of that weight that I was carrying. I just felt lifted in that moment. It was the first time I felt good in a long time. So it became this meditative thing for me that just brought me so much peace. It helped ground me. It helped put everything in perspective. It started out simply with just basic hand feeding. I wanted to like try to feed them by my mouth or through my nose or through my ears. And I started to do all of those crazy things. And then I kind of ran out of uh, real estate on my body <laughs> to feed them with. And I had to introduce props. I have like all these crazy different props. Here's a wig that I turned into a feeder. I was not telling my friends and family about it. I'm like, because the moment I tell them, it's gonna like fizzle out and I'm gonna be yesterday's news. So only recently did people start to reach out to me and say, James, do you have something to tell us? Like I'm seeing these videos of you. My mom went to get her hair cut and her hairdresser said, my daughter follows your son on TikTok. And my mom was like, what are you talking about? So all of my family have these little stories of like the first time they heard about this alter ego hum daddy that I have. If this inspires anyone to want to do this and feed hummingbirds, there is just a certain level of responsibility that comes with it. Feed them the right things and clean your feeders. Do it responsibly. Have a great time.